We'll start with a Mustard Heritage Classic Wet, size 10. This is the S70. I have a little length of lead wire, or lead free wire, whichever you prefer. And we just put this on the front of the hook. Just tighten that in. Pull it back a little because we need room to finish at the front there. So I have sheer 40 naught olive. So we just attach this at the front. Now if you keep a strand on like this, it makes going over the lead wire much easier for the first time. Like so. And I just put a stopper at the back there to stop that lead wire moving and I stop at the front and we go on top like so now what we need is this is uh, a olive uh, body yarn, Antron body yarn I'm using a light olive and a dark olive as you can see here now what we need to do is we take the two ends and we want to cut these even. Then we come up here and we just tack those in and we go to the back here and just secure that leg wire like so. Then we take the two strands and we twist them. quite tight twist only one way of course like that and we take a whip finish tool and we can measure the body that will do me about there and I come into there and I let it go there's the extended, extended damsel nymph body so I'll just come in here and secure that with a couple of turns like so then we'll go up on the lead wire again and go wee ways forward we pull that back and tie it down put those out the way I'll spin my tying thread anti-clockwise to give it a flat profile like so, then I can split it, we'll open up our thread. I've loaded a Petit Jean clip with uh, two olive CDCs, put the whole clip in. hold that there and then we'll spin up clockwise like so into a dubbing brush and then we we'll go forward pull everything back and secure at the front that's good then we take our two strands of Antron body yarn we can open the CDC pull this forward tighten that up for the in case make a couple of turns like that then what I want to do is trim this off to about there 
we separate these down each side there we are start at the hook eye Build up a decent head, that's good. And we take our whip finisher like so. Remove the tying thread, then we pull all this all the CDC and Antron that we put at the front for the legs up like this and we trim them off play the super long ones if you don't want them And that's the finished furled damsel nymph. If you enjoy the videos, please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.